Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make a colorful split clone effect in After Effects. First of all let's grab a roto brush tool and double click on a clip. Rotoscope the car as smooth as possible. Once you are done, click on freeze button. As the freezing is done, close rotoscoping window and then duplicate that layer. I will rename duplicated one to car only. Then duplicate car only layer and rename top one to car only main. Now select your very bottom clip and make sure to delete roto brush effect on it. Now let's select car only layer, the middle one and press T on your keyboard, then hold shift and press P and S, make sure you are at the very beginning of a car only layer and then click on position and opacity stopwatch icons to create keyframes. Now I will decrease the scale to around 66 and then change opacity to 0%. Now scroll forward a bit and change opacity back to 100%. Scroll to the middle of your clip and move the position up like that. Scroll forward near to the end and then create new opacity keyframe there. Now scroll to the very end and change opacity to 0%. Then right click on position and select reset. Let's quickly check what we have done. A few more effects and adjustments are left and we are ready. Now let's select only position keyframes and hit F9 on a keyboard to easy ease them. Then go to graph editor, right click here and select edit speed graph and make a smooth curve like mine. Let's check it one more time. Looks nice. Close graph editor and make sure to scroll where the second position keyframe is and then apply find edges effect. Check invert and then apply tint effect. Change map white to any color you want. Now apply a glow effect, I will use a deep glow plugin, in case you don't have it, DM me on Instagram a word, glow, and then wait for my reply. Now let's duplicate car only layer and then press P on your keyboard and move the position up. Then click on map white to and change the color on a duplicated car only layer. Also let's rotate it horizontally, right click on duplicated car only layer, go to transform and select flip horizontal. Duplicate car only layer one more time and press P on a keyboard and move position up. Then change the color on that one as well. I will flip this one horizontally, because I want only a middle one to be flipped. Now we can check the effect and see what we can add more. Looks nice, but let's enable motion blur on all car only layers. That looks way better. To make this effect even better, we can add shake effects or you can leave it like that. I will skip shake part because you can find shake tutorials on the channel, or check this video's description, I will leave a tutorial link there. Also I have made 16 advanced shake effects that you can get from the link in the description. Check how it looks like with the shakes. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.